What is continuous delivery? Contrary to common perception, continuous delivery isn't a specific set of tools or an off-the-shelf product. Continuous delivery is a journey, a company culture, the art of delivering changes to production safely, quickly and sustainably. Now, where do we begin? Continuous integration is a great start. Work in small batches and set up an automatic integration tollgate that checks the quality of your changes. This allows you to quickly share your changes with colleagues without ever breaking the build. After the integration, run some code analysis tools. The metrics can really help make your weekly code reviews more effective and keeps technical debt in check. Up next, automatically deploy your product to a test environment. This allows you to test your deployment procedures, removes manual deployment errors, and facilitates an otherwise painful process. With your product now deployed in a realistic test environment, you can easily conduct a thorough and long-running functional tests. Now we're confident enough to start preparing a potential release. Generate documentation, release notes, and package everything up. At this point, releasing is just choosing one of your release candidates that made it through your pipeline. Remember, continuous delivery is not something you implement, it's something you practice. Foster a culture of self-improvement and cooperation. Work together to eliminate bottlenecks, simplify your processes, and automate them.